A sextant is a very simple machine. It has basically one moving part, but it has two mirrors on it. A mirror here and a mirror here. The top one is the one that moves. Having two mirrors lets you see two things at once, like a double, double exposure. It can be two people in this room, it can be the, uh, the sun in the sky, or whatever it is, this tells you the angle between them. It's just a simple angle measuring thing. If it's one degree away from overhead, the sextant would read uh, 89 degrees up, you would be on a circle of one degree, which is 60 miles, you'd be on a circle around where the sun is. And you can actually plot that circle on your chart if you wanted to. Then, when the sun moves to another point of the sky later on in the day, you can do the whole thing again and get another circle, and where the circles intersect, you're at one of those points. That's how celestial navigation works. That's the whole course. If you ever do play golf, the first day you go out, you will play golf. I mean, you're bound to hit the ball once in a while, and you're going to lose a lot of golf balls. You know, get a very high score, but you are playing golf the first day, and you can do the same thing with celestial navigation. And it has the same attraction for you later on, because you can add things, you can, you can shoot planets in the daytime, you can do all kinds of tricks, the moon at night, and doing all kinds of things with it. And so some people make a hobby of it just throughout their lives, just to try to get better.